Anyway, and that's off Scott McDonald on the television during an interview, and he was going at great pains to not say the name old firm. Then when he eventually did, backtracked quite quickly, straight back to Glasgow Derby. So, you know, it's just frustrating. Why can't people call this Derby game like others, like the El Clasico? You wouldn't call that the whatever other Derby. You know, that's what it is. Um, and I think that's a, a frustration. Um, Craig Moore, old firm or not old firm? Old firm Derby for me all day long. I've always seen it as the old firm derby and, and and nothing has changed for me. I mean, everyone's got their their their, their own take, I guess. But um, since coming back, and I've been back now 18 months and we've we've done a bit pre, pre-show and that sort of stuff. And for me, it's it's the old firm derby. Mm-hmm. That's the that's the game that's around the corner. That's a title decider that's coming on Sunday. It's the old firm derby. John, old firm? Well, I've said I've said Celtic Rangers in the last uh, few times <laughs> that I've been on. Mm-hmm. Um I think there's a, you know, there's a, there's a view. A lot of Celtic fans now say the Glasgow derby, and they have their own. They have to come on here and discuss why. But there's more than one it. Glasgow derby, isn't there? Yeah, but what I'm saying to you is, if it's Rangers, you'd say, you know, Rangers Celtic, uh, and I've got, I've been saying that myself because a lot of the Celtic fans don't like to say the old firm, and as you know, I am Celtic. I'm not Rangers, if you like. Um, and if you ask other players, listen, the old firm, it's its always been called the old firm and the Celtic fans now decided to call it and, you know, they can come on and explain why. Um, is that not quite I, a big I, selling point? I mean, as, as Craig was saying there, well, is, is that, not one, of, is that not one of the fixture's big selling points? You know, when you do headline it as old firm, showdown or whatever. To some people, yes, but not to others. Mm-hmm. So yeah, they'd have their reasons why. Um, what would you say, to, Craig? What would you say to John? Well, well listen, I've got great respect for you, John. Of mm. course I do. You know, but uh, uh, you know, to me, what I can't get—it's to me—it's to take away from that somebody saying from it, and also there's the fact mm. that Celtic as a football club still make money off of the trademark old firm, as do Rangers. I'm not saying it's loads, but they do. So when they come out and their boards coming out with statements saying. Well, not half of anything. Well, then, to me, if they really truly believe that, if that's if that is heart on their heart what they believe, then they should be saying, as of now, we're going to scrap anything to do for them. We're not going to make any money off it. And then you might have a more, as a club, you might have a more different argument. Fans, you know, again, it, it is a slap in the face to the fans because it's, they say you're no more important than a game against Partick Thistle. That is how it feels as the Rangers. And I grew up. You know, old firm derby. What you played in, John, was the old firm derby. What Craig played in was the old firm derby. And to me, it's still, it still is that. So when you kind of get diminished to, uh, uh, it's like Patrick this or it's a Glasgow derby. Yeah, that that does anger fans. Um, uh, and, and you know, what, do you see it that way, Craig? Do you do you do you see it as a big a big selling point, not just in the UK and in Scotland, but around the world? I think more so, um, Rob, around the world, because when when you're here in the goldfish bowl, you know you kind of you're a little bit more uh, maybe sensitive or up to date with everything. And um, you know Glasgow's a small place, but I think when you talk globally uh, in terms of the supporter bases that are around the world, I mean, for me, the 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 old firm is uh, is as a great selling point. Uh, I understand that that both clubs um, want to be bigger than the other. Um, that comes with great rivalry. Um, I've got no no kind of issue with that. From my my personal experience, from my time uh, playing in Scotland for twelve years, uh, and also recently being back, and I've seen it from other parts of the world. I, I just feel as if like a, a strong Rangers and Celtic is is fantastic for Scottish football. Tell Alexa to launch Go Radio or listen on the Go Radio app.